guys, it's Kathy here. Welcome back to my channel. I'm out here in the shade house today and you can see all my plants look really nice and lush and beautiful. But I just wanted to show you something and talk about it, um, about my failures as well. And I did something, I'm always up for a bit of experimental gardening and what I did was I planted some beans out of season and I thought that they would be okay but it's really cold here. So I'll just show you what they look like now. I'll turn you around. Okay, so you can see down here they've just pretty much all died. So what I'm going to do is cut the cut my losses there with those I kind of had a feeling that they wouldn't grow but I thought maybe in here protected they would but they've all just slowly died <laughs> And what I'll do with the rest of those pots is I'm transplanting my broccoli into them. So as you know I do a lot of container gardening and here the soil is not very good at all. So what I've done is I'm planting my things out one in each pot and everything is going really really healthy. So guys when I'm repotting my seedlings out into bigger pots what I do is I fill up about at least half the bottom of it with mulch and twigs and leaf matter and then I just put in the soil for the top half especially in the bigger pots and it makes your soil go a lot further but you're also getting all the nutrients out of the organic matter that's in the bottom and as time goes on that'll break down and be a really good source of nutrients for your soil but what I do is if the pot after a few weeks if it starts to get look a bit lower with the soil I just top it up with soil it's just a really good way to stretch your soil and make it go further so I collect my leaf matter in this bin and I've just got some pots on top there and I just use that in the bottom of the pots and then I fill it up here with this really nice organic compost that I've been using and it just helps things to grow really really beautifully we've really noticed the difference mum and I both since I've been using this really good aged organic compost that all our things are growing so much better everything looks fantastic and i've got some other stuff here some transplants that need to go out as well but i'm just waiting on some more soil but as you can see that's only like about a week and a half to two weeks i've put them in there and these are wombox they're growing really really well and that was a tiny little plant and I wasn't sure that that would survive but it did and yeah they're all going really well but I just wanted to show you that it's not all sunshine and butterflies and sometimes we make mistakes and I knew pretty much that this was going to happen I thought uh, I'll just try it and see how it goes but all's not lost because I can just transplant my broccoli straight into those pots and it's not a loss then okay guys have a good one bye all right you lot come on edward Whoop. 